Well, hello everybody. Uh, it's Jake back again. Going to do some more uh, work on the motorcycle. I got my trusty assistant, Josh, over here. So if you give me a second here, I'm going to turn the camera around and get it set. And then we'll go. All right. So what we're going to start with is uh, the new headlight assembly. Because to do the handlebars, I've got to take off the headlight assembly. So kind of put in my last post what I was getting. So now we're going to see what this thing looks like. All right. So this looks like it is the bar that will mount and it's got the turn signals attached to the bottom I'll grab a snack. oh snacks are good what snack did you get fruit, fruit roll fruit roll up i've got my liquid snack right here some diet on arnold palmer this is what they look like they have tattoos for your tongue mm. i could show you one of them if you were that yeah you can show it to me all right let's pull this out There's a half of a crown. Yeah, looks like a sneaker. Half, a, half of a game controller. That's kind of cool. And so this looks pretty nice. I mean, these half of a shoe, um, feel. a whole shoe, and a yeah, this sign. Very cool. So this piece should mount right to where the headlight currently, or the turn signals currently are mounted. I'll have to grab a wrench and twist these in, but let's see what else we got in here. These look like the passing lights themselves. plastic film. I'm going to leave that plastic film on until I get it installed. Mm. So it's got kind of a cool little eagle thing right there. You see that? Yeah, I was about to say that was cool. Um, they are plastic, but I knew they were plastic. So these appear to be like metal or chrome, but this piece is plastic. So that will mount somehow right there with my headlight being here in the middle. So we've got two of those. Wait, you can have two extra lights? Yeah. I didn't know that. Yep. Two extra lights, new handlebars. Oh, that's gonna look, it will look way more cooler. Way more cooler. Mm. So there's that. I may at some point, once I measure these um, out, uh, replace these light inserts here with some LED retrofits. Um, but I'm gonna put them on like this first and see how they light up before I do that. Uh, I've heard different things about the LED kits. So I- I got a smoothie. I got a smoothie. Mm -hmm. And I had one of these for lunch. Nice. And, I, and it has this um, Paw Patrol character. Very I don't cool. remember his name. I don't know his name either. It's Zuma. Zuma. Nice. So like most of these things, uh, they don't come with any directions. So basically what we got here is to figure it out. Oh. <laughs> you, you, you just shot some yogurt on my sleeve. <laughs> Which, if there's no instructions, that means it's a puzzle to figure out. It does mean it's a puzzle to figure out. So, now, if when you watch some of these videos I do, my wife will make fun of me because I am not the most handy person <laughs> when it comes to this type of stuff. And so, it'll probably take me a bit to figure out how this is supposed to go. So probably like a couple days. Is going to clearly go in like there and 
there. So that's that. Ah, I see what it does. Yep. Just like that. All right, so first thing we're going to do is get this out of here. Excuse me. And then this goes on the inside of that. Hey, Josh, you want to get me a Phillips head screwdriver, buddy? Be a good assistant. What's a Phillips? The one that has that head. What? Um. Yeah. Thanks, bud. Thanks. Phillips head screwdriver. I'm gonna so. go get you some more tools. This down. Tighten this down. And then this is going to sit here. It's got a little square piece in there to hold the bolt still. And that goes through. That answers that question. I should have checked that before. That washer is not for that. So put that bolt through. Oh, thanks, bud. I don't think I need all of those, though. But thank you for getting them for me. Hey, bud. So I'm not sure yet about this thing here. It kind of looks funky to me. Like, why would they have a bolt hanging down? But this one. That's the only one that fits through there and has a square nut, so stuff's made in China. Maybe they didn't really think about it. Or, no. We'll look and see once we get it all together. this one said I'm not the most handy person in the world here so I'm just trying to figure out I almost think I'd like that better but I just don't know if that will fit it's 
never a good sign when I just felt some threads come off of the uh, thing. And this looks a little funky too, but I think I almost would prefer that going up instead of being down. Yeah, we don't we don't need the helpers, buddy. All of these people you see, yeah, if they even though they look like Mungus characters, yep, they're still helpers. So this is interesting in that they the... just help us with the screws. Oh, here's pink. Screws that go into the side. Oh, and here's They had, the... bud. Hey, I'm trying to make a video about this, not about your Among Us characters, okay? So we don't want to talk about those. That. No, they're not helping us. Can you look and see if I dropped somewhere on the floor two little circle things like that? Sure. Here, Red, you come help me. I don't see two more washers. But those washers did not fit over this. So it doesn't make a whole lot of sense. So for right now, I'm just going to put this on. Where is it? Dad, I can't find it. Okay, buddy. So what do I do? Uh, nothing. Might have forgotten the part. They may have. Yeah, because it's definitely the hole's big enough for washers. But it just doesn't have another two washers unless they're underneath all of the stuff that uh, you keep putting on the table. No. 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 All the Among Us characters are fine. Wait. Oh, I think I see. I see. Where? All right, well, I'm going to do a quick little thing where I'm going to take this bolt, because I do like the way that this came together better, flip it around, and then there's only supposed to be a washer on one side of these. But theoretically, generally, this is what it'll look like and it'll go right on the front of the bike. So on my next video, I'll start taking the headlight apart and kind of show you a better placement of what it'll look like. All right, so that's it. Thanks for watching. If you would like to see some more of this, make sure you click the like, the subscribe, uh, so you can be updated when I make a new video. All right, bye-bye.